Okay, tell me your name. I'm Dave Brabel, and I'm the founder of the Guardians of the Ribbon and the Pink Heels Tour. Wow, so tell yeah. me about what you guys do. We basically provide love and hope in the form of pink fire trucks to honor all women on the planet and put you first in your battle for life against cancer. Wow. That's we, uh, wonderful. We uh, started with one truck three years ago on $3,000. We now have 17, 10 chapters, and 3,000 cities have adopted our resolution or proclamation to serve their women by wearing her color pink and then raising money within that community off of our program. They keep the money. We ask for nothing. We do this for free. Wow. So you just travel around the country? Yeah. We, well, we were firefighters, and we take our own vacation to do it. So we travel two and a half months a year to different cities all over the country to provide love and hope to those communities to bring more people together in the fight for life for women. We believe in our organization that men were put here specifically to protect our women at all costs. They should be number one in our lives and we truly believe, like a savings account, that they'll give ten times back to us if we selflessly march on her behalf. So none of us have been affected by cancer. We do this for her because she's perfect. Wow, what a wonderful thing. So your truck is called Karen. Yep, Karen was, uh, the Karen gave us uh, a check, $13,000 check, three years ago, and she's a friend of mine now, of course, to buy our first truck, and then a year later she came down with lung cancer. So we named the first truck Karen. The back of the truck there is Elaine, and she's the mayor of where I work, and she came down with breast cancer. Oh, wow. So since here we just keep naming trucks after women like beautiful battleships in this war, this, this, we created this war against this terrorist cancer. So we as men in this country are at war for our women. Wow, and so you are, um, you're traveling, you, you just collect firefighters all over the country? To firefighters, join? police officers, politicians, Congress, uh, anybody that has anything to do with needing a vote in this country better get them their tail in a pink shirt, let their women know that they love them, let their communities know that they love them, let them know they put them first in their battle for life. It's a true calling. We were put here on this planet as men and as leaders and as communities to put our women first at all costs. I'm not reinventing a wheel that hasn't been going since the time since time began. Yeah. That's what we're doing. It's simple. It's providing love, inspiration, and hope to communities to come together for the most important people in our communities. And it's our females, our women. Wow. What a lovely it's mission. It's awesome. It's no, it's incredible. it's a uh, if the world was round, of course it is, and we tell our kids at a school, sixty percent of that world, if you divide it in half like a pie, would be pink. The other 40% would be blue. The reason why great countries are great is how we treat our women. If the blue marches on behalf of the pink selflessly, the pink gives us 10 times back. That's what we need to do. It's that simple. We don't care where you go to church. We love you. We don't care who you voted for. We love you. We are marching on behalf, on behalf of you because we love you. Wow. So it, it is perfect. I love doing what I'm doing. I'm going to have 200 of these trucks. We're in 3,000 cities now. We're going to tour the country. We're going to have conventions. I want to someday rally these trucks together, bring in female speakers, bring in people that can inspire us and direct us even to a stronger level of support, and let's really find a cure to cancer. Yeah. This is a selfless march to push those people that may have those answers to hurry up because we're sick and tired of watching our women suffer, not our direct women. Yeah. Women around the world should never get cancer. Yeah. So. so what do you need? What do you need help with? I need every woman out there that can get this message out to go to their community leaders. Remember, you have men's men marching on your behalf. You have a mission statement and a movement that t does all the talking for you. You provide all our information on our website, pinkfiretrucks.org. You send that to a community leader. You basically ask them, because they're going to do it for sure, get in pink, show your women that they're number one in their lives, raise money, keep that money in your own communities. This is about you selling our mission statement. We provide the muscle to get it done for your communities. Very nice. Thank you so much. And tell me your name again. I'm Dave Grable. Thank you.